Let me pose a question to the audience today. What is the purpose of the fire department? The answer is, in short, to save lives and property. This is what I'd like to call into question in today's video. I am not sure who filmed this video to give them credit. It was sent to me. I could not find it on the internet. What we have here is a single family dwelling with fire in the attic. If our job is to save lives and property, I'm going to propose that these firefighters could have done a far better job than what we are witnessing in this video. Allow me to explain. As they arrive on scene, they find that the fire is contained in the attic. There is light smoke in the dwelling. They are in no danger. For those of you who do not know, you can almost let the roof burn off of a home without severely impacting the occupancy below. I say this because that means the firefighters have a certain amount of time to do salvage work before they engage the fire above. They could have located the attic crawl space and not pulled a bunch of debris all over the occupancy. If there wasn't a crawl space, they should have taken the time to put down a floor runner or a salvage cover to protect the floor, move the furniture out of the way, bag the room that they were going to be working in. Bagging is where you cover the valuables and plastic in the center of the room to protect them from destruction and water damage. But none of that was done. They just ripped open the ceiling and started spraying water. Where was the captain slash officer who was supposed to be guiding these firefighters? Where was the ladder that they would need to climb up into the attic and extinguish the fire? In a confined space, water will expand at a rate of 1700 to 1. Even in an open environment, water can expand at a rate of 450 to 1. The art of firefighting is a science. We have to learn, know, master our profession. Overall, this was a subpar operation and I think I've shown it as an example of what not to do. We must do better.